Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I planned on doing a taste test slash review of the new Coca-Cola product, Coke with Coffee Caramel Flavor. But after a quick trip to YouTube, I saw there's a massive handful of reviews that cover all the basic points already. So I decided I had to do something drastic to ensure my reviews stand out amongst the competition. That is why in today's video, we will not simply taste and review the product. Instead, we will use it to prepare some ramen. Ramen is a pretty straightforward thing to make, so I'm not going to waste your time talking about proportions or anything else like that. Instead, I want to take this time to talk to you about my pet pig, Dusty, who sadly passed away last year by the hands of Mad Farmer Mason, the town's local egghead and part-time stand-up comedian. Dusty was a simple pig, and he didn't mean anyone no harm, and I miss him every day. Now that the coke ramen is done, let's see how it ended up. Honestly, I'm quite disappointed in the flavor. I feel like this does not taste bad enough to be considered content worthy, and we must make something worse for the sake of views. While I tried to come up with a more compelling and content worthy meal to prepare using Coke with coffee, I decided to take a drive out to the farm where I first found Dusty, my late pet pig. When he was still quite young, Dusty was infatuated with magic and even had a magic themed birthday party once. One time, after weeks of practicing, he used his kids' lab magic kit to put on a magic show for the family. That was one of the happiest days of my life, and watching Dusty be proud of something meant the world to me. It is hard to believe he's actually gone. To make this dish, we first need 36 ounces of Coke with coffee caramel flavor. The rest of the ingredients and instructions are all listed on the box, so there's no reason to tell them to you. All this talk about coke and coffee and pasta and caramel reminds me of a quote from an inspirational novel I used to read as a kid. My guardian is the planet of silence, soldier of death and rebirth, sailor Saturn. Anyway, for generations we have tested the waters within the world of cooking and baking to finally learn what is both feasible and practical. Now we know what our limitations are. Macaroni and cheese and coke and coffee and caramel is the furthest we've gone to push boundaries within the last 50 years, and I'm honored to be the first to try this meal, which I can only assume will be a staple found on the menu at every Olive Garden or Olive Garden variant going forward. Now is the moment of truth, and I'm excited to see how this will be an improvement from the coke with coffee caramel flavor hot and spicy ramen with shrimp. Just based on looks alone, I'm positive this dish will bring me thousands of YouTube views and a possible sponsorship with either or both Coca-Cola and Mac Craft and Cheese. Here we go with the taste test. Um. 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 This is okay. This is fine. This tastes fine. I'm fine. 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 This is this okay. Is okay. This, this tastes taste taste good. good. I'm having a, I'm good, having time. a good time. I, I don't feel anything bad.
dear Daryl, I just can't believe it. I just can't. I am so, so sorry for what happened. It was just so sudden and unexpected. Can't even wrap my head around how he must be feeling. But I love you. Please stay strong. If you need anything, anything at all, just let me know. Please reach out if you need me. Seriously. Dusty will be missed, man. By all of us. Best wishes, Lenny. Dear Daryl, I want to send my love to you and your family at this tragic time. I can only imagine how hard this is for you to go through. I, I guess I, I didn't know him very long, but just in the short time I knew him, Dusty made such a strong impact on my life. It's, it's important to focus on the time we got with him while he was here. There, there really isn't much else we can do, I guess. Stay strong, friend. I love you. And, and Dusty's looking down on you. I'm sending you love to. I know he is. Take care, Daryl. Love, Matthew. Daryl. I sat down to write you the moment I heard about Dusty. I can't believe he's gone. What a wonderful pig he was. God, you remember that one time the whole family was together? Dusty had us all gather around the picnic table so we could show off the magic kit he'd been practicing with for weeks and weeks. He was so fucking proud of himself afterwards, and he had every right to be too. That pig had a shine in his heart like no other. He was a good pig, and you were a great friend to him for as long as you could be. Take care, Daryl. One step at a time. One step at a time. Your friend, Grace. I'm so sad that I see the pig is dead. Mad Farmer Mace is an Oh, I, ca I can't believe it's he's fucking I dead. Tell you. Why? God, why? That's he was just a pig, that. man. Oh, you do it. Oh, what this is causing oh, you. 
It should have been me. It should have been me. It should have been me. Best Patrick. Best wishes. Yo, Daryl. I heard about Dusty. And I'm, I'm sorry, man. I mean, we all knew how crazy Darryl, that farmer guy was. I heard about your pig, man. I just didn't know it could I'm get so as bad sorry. as it did. He was such a I nice guess nobody guy. did. He was taking I'm just to sorry. He's some of the guys love that pig and talking. Dusty. Sure we think we should be mad farmers. That's all that really matters. Matters. Oh. Dusty really oh. loved him. He's right thing very I hope he stays strong. I know it's hard right now, but it'll get better. We have the mayor's back I promise. He said he wanted to throw the first swing himself. series severance it's on apple tv plus uh i love it. it's getting great reviews congrats by the way thanks man uh uh adam scott who i, I love as well uh, it's a trippy it's a trippy concept yeah it's um i'm not in it i directed it and uh with another director Ethan mccarl great director and produced but it's adam scott starring with uh patricia arquette and john patricia Turturro, is chris walken uh, um, but he plays a guy who works at a company where he gets
Okay, here we go, here we go. A little rusty at this, we got it. Hey, welcome back to the Coke Starlight review. Uh, today we're looking at uh, Coke Starlight. Uh, it's this new Coca-Cola... No, I need more hands, more hands. Hey guys, welcome back to Coke Starlight review. Uh, too much hands. Take it back, take it back, I, I lied. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we're looking at the Coca... God damn it, I can't do this. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Coca-Cola Starlight Review. No, I, I can't do this on an empty stomach. Let's see what we have here. Oh, no, no, no. No, I don't think so. Mm, maybe, th no, I don't. Uh, oh, what if I go? <laughs> Daryl, 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 are you listening to me? Huh, what? Oh, yeah, sorry. You spaced out again. What were you thinking about? Oh, um, uh, nothing. You need to be honest with me, Daryl. I know, I know, I'm trying, it's just... Are you still having the dream? Which one? You know which one. Yeah, I, I am. Open up the Describe it to me. What has changed since we last spoke? It always starts the same. With me sitting in my house. But it's not your house, is it? It's fucking you, isn't it? No. No, but it, it feels like my house. It feels exactly like where I'm supposed to be. Is it still a barn? Sometimes, it changes. Is there anyone with you? Fuck you. Fuck you, man. Yeah, my pet pig. You don't have a pig. You don't have a pig, Daryl. You, you, you don't have a pig, Daryl. No, but I used to. What was his name? Everybody told me not to fucking come here. Everybody said it couldn't be that little fucking strange boy down the road, but I fucking knew. I knew it was fucking you the way you would fucking stand out there, look at Frankie, look at my dad. I f fuck you, dude. I swear to God, I know it was you. I know it was fucking you. I know you called him a fucking egghead, you sick fuck. I fucking wanted you to die. I sat in the hospital every guy. Every goddamn day, every goddamn Saturday, every day I sat there waiting for him to wake up, letting me know it was fucking you, and it never fucking, he never fucking woke up, man. Uh, I don't know. Does the dream still end the same way? Always. Describe it to me. I fucking knew it was you! I open the fridge and I pull out a can of Coke with coffee and then... Daryl. Daryl, we have been over this too many times. That product isn't real, Daryl. I just... I just need you to admit that. Please, for the love of God, just admit that it's not real and we will finally be able to end this whole facade. I, I know what I fucking saw, okay? You're lying to me, Daryl. Your dreams are wrong. 
it is real. I've seen it with my own eyes. They have three flavors, dark blend, vanilla, and- You made this Coke and coffee concoction yourself. It's not fucking possible for them to come packaged together in one single 12 fluid ounce can. Are you crazy? Do I have to get somebody on the line? Do I have to call the people up now to take you away? Is that what I have to do? Is that what it's come down to? I know what I saw. <laughs> Daryl, Daryl, no, no, hold on. Hold on a second. Hold that thought. Wait. Hold on. You got this. We are gathered here today to remember someone close to our hearts. Not as who they are now, or who they were in their last moments, but who they were throughout their whole life, and who they were to each and every one of us throughout their whole life. Dusty the Pig was one of those influential characters that as soon as he meets you he becomes imprinted on your heart and every moment with him is a memory you will never forget you know i think of the bible verse where god is talking about how he is going to together once more. Dusty is just ahead of us all right now, waiting, waiting for us to finally catch up. Dusty. My flesh and my heart faileth, but God is the strength of my heart and my portion forever. I want to lead us all now in a song. It was uh, one of Dusty's favorite hymns, and I think it's a great song to sing right now for all of us. And just make sure we sing loud enough that Dusty can hear. Okay? And uh, after this song, uh, Father Greg is going to lead us in a closing prayer. Everyone turn to uh, page 118 in your hymnals. Some glad morning when this life is o'er I'll fly away, fly away, fly away to a home on God's celestial shore I'll fly away, fly away, fly away I'll fly away, fly away, oh glory I'll fly away, fly away in the morning when I die
Daryl? Daryl, it's me. It's your late pig, Dusty. That funky little guy that puts a little bit of magic in every step. Dusty, is it... is it really you? You better believe it, hot mama. What are you doing? I, I mean, you, you're dead. I may be dead, but your heart keeps me alive, Daryl. I don't understand. Am I, am I dreaming? No, baby, I'm as real as it gets. I came to tell you that it's time to move on, buddy. But I, I don't want to. You'll never want to, but nobody ever does. It just hurts to watch you be so miserable all the time. You gotta start doing what you love again. Don't let me keep you from that. So I need to go back to law school. No, no, idiot. You could never make it as a lawyer. Never, ever will you, of all people, become a lawyer. Give that up. Give it up right now. Never bring that up again to anyone. No, I'm talking about your sweet, sweet soda reviews. I mean, I don't know, Dusty. It was just some stupid pipe dream. Follow your heart, Daryl. Follow your heart. Just not into law. I must go now. I can hear the angels call my name. Wait, there's still so much I want to say. There is not the time. Goodbye, Daryl. No, don't go. Please. There's one last thing I need to tell you before I go. What is it, Dusty? Hell is real. It's fucking real. We're all here. Your mom is here, too. It's horrible. It's horrible. Black, black, black is the color of my true love's hair. His lips are something wondrous fair. The pure stars and the bravest hands. I love the ground whereon he stands. Black, black, black is the color of my true love's hair. I love my love and well he knows 
I love the ground where on he goes, and if no more, my love I'd see my life would fade in misery. Black, black, black is the color of my true.